The first thing that I'll say about Ron is vision. There are lots of people that talk about vision and a lot of people like to be visionaries, but Ron truly had a vision. Ron Allred has had a direct impact on the development and enhancement of major ski resort communities throughout the state, turning the town of Avon into a reality and transforming the struggling ski area of Telluride into a world-class ski resort. Born and raised in Grand Junction, Ron began his professional career as a dentist. In the 1970s, the rapidly growing interest in skiing prompted Ron to turn his attention to the ski industry. We had adopted the concept of let's find a ski area to develop the land around the ski area to sell off lots to pay for all the infrastructure. And we found Beaver Creek, but we couldn't buy it because we were about two weeks late. So we did the next best thing. We bought uh, the land where the town of Avon is. Even in those days, Ron could focus forward 10, 20 years, and he saw a, a city, he saw a lake being created, and he saw hundreds of millions of dollars in much needed development to assist in the development of both Vail and Beaver Creek. As a major part of the Vail Valley, this development has become not only a commercial and employment core for the area, but its own significant community as well. Eager to become more involved in development, Ron ventured to the struggling community of Telluride and immediately saw potential for a world-class resort. The first day I arrived in the town of Telluride, there were so many boarded up places, so many commercial lots that were vacant, and the mining was shutting down. And I'll never forget the first time I met him, I said, what are we going to do? What's the plan? And he says, our plan, this is true story, and the first time, second time I ever met him, is to be the top year-round mountain resort in North America. All the obstacles that he saw here, he viewed as opportunities. That's what I think was really incredible. There was no airport, it was hard to get to, it was behind the curve, not a lot had been done. By the 1980s, construction had begun on the new mountain village. And the lifts were better, everything got improved, areas were opened up that were never opened up before. And this was a vision, but a lot of it he accepted judgment from other people. Some people that have visions don't listen to other people, but Ron listened intently. During the 1990s, Ron's plan for the inaugural major first-class hotel were complete, and it would prove to have a huge impact on tourism with a unique gondola system built to serve as the transportation link between the old town and the new mountain village. The gondola was a remarkable innovation, and particularly to make it available to everyone for, for no cost. Uh, that was unlike any of the other resorts that I was familiar with. So I think Ron's whole approach was thinking about it from uh, the people he was trying to attract to Telluride. And uh, they weren't necessarily uh, triple black diamond um, people looking for extreme skiing. They were looking for a great family uh, experience. Overcoming enormous obstacles, Ron turned Telluride into a year-round destination with golf courses, an airport, and a world-renowned film festival, not to mention access to beautiful terrain. Ron has served on the board of directors of Colorado Ski Country and on the board of directors for the Telluride Medical District while helping to establish the Telluride Foundation, supporting local community groups and nonprofits. Ron's real vision, I think, was just about helping people. And he saw that by creating the foundation, uh, it was not only a way to give back, but it was also a way to really celebrate and support the things that he really believed in, you know, building the community. With determination, vision, and leadership, Ron Allred helped enhance two major ski areas in Colorado, transforming these communities and developing the ski industry. <music>